welcome back everybody thank you very much that you came back um, so first of all I would like to say again thank you to my new subscribers you are helping me a lot to keep this channel going thank you so much and also thank you for the old subscribers who are coming back this uh, really makes me happy and I feel your energy so uh, I feel like we are already like a small family so let's uh, stay together a bit longer today and uh, chat about what is his next step so basically i will be looking at the past the presents and the future of this connection and also i will be explaining you what's happening uh, what will be his next step and there will be no extended video everything will be in included in this one video so let's have a look what we have today so today we have five piles. We have uh, pile one, pile two, pile three, pile four, and pile five. You will see the time steps stamps uh, below the video in the description. And uh, so we will be looking at uh, at him. What are his actions? What are his next steps? So let's have a look. Please focus, concentrate, connect with your mind and body. Don't think about anything, just uh, pick that pile whichever resonates most with you. And you can also pause the video if you like. All right, and I start moving this aside. All right. Hi, Pile One, welcome to your reading. So today we are going to have a look at uh, what is his next step, alright? So, okay, let's have a look. So we have the Magician, Justice, Two of Pentacles, the Hermit, Four of Cups, the Strength, Ten of Cups, Six of Swords, Ace of Wands. That's beautiful. Alright. Okay. So let me see here what we have. Can you all see that? Not really, but I can try to move them up a little bit. All right. So I see that in the past your person was a little bit juggling, like between his career and you or between the two things, two aspects in his life, you and uh, work, you and his, himself, you and maybe some other person as well, maybe you and his friends. So he was really juggling in the past, he was not able to decide and he was some kind of like sometimes a bit confused, he was uh, leaving this connection to go you know just he went just with the, with the flow he just uh, didn't think about it a lot but i see that for sure you were his dream come true because he was trying to manifest you in the past and he was uh, really dreaming about the type of person like you are and uh, he wanted someone who is really fair who is uh, worth it you know who has all these qualities which he dreamed of to have in his one person so i can see that this person um there was some kind of a really nice connection between you two i don't see any any drama or something but uh, your person went a bit uh, quiet uh, lately and maybe he you are not talking so much anymore uh, he is just uh, right now maybe you know thinking about all this what has happened and maybe he is just uh, trying to to think about everything what will be the future of our connection and he keep he, he needs time he needs time and space you know and uh, your person might be a leo or earth sign or water sign and um, a strong fire as well yeah so your person went quiet and that's why you are asking what's gonna happen what is his next step and what is he thinking about so right now he is focusing on his 
career probably or on his friends on his family like mom dad sister brother maybe he's just you know he wants to enjoy himself to be without you for a while and to think about everything what has happened um, and he is trying to get some courage you know he is being strong he is like a lion you know he is really like um, um, really able to if he wants he will be able to fight for the connection he has a lot a lot of strength so what I see right now, he, he needs to somehow gather all his energy back into normal and he needs to think about all whatever has happened. And uh, right now he doesn't see the, the worth of the connection, what could have, could have happened, you know. And I see that you would like to you would like to have a deeper connection with this person and you would like to find this stability and this uh, really beautiful blossoming relationship full of harmony, full of joy and happiness and uh, maybe you would like to, some of you also have a family with this person and would like to have a child with him um, for some of you, yeah, and for some of you, you would like to travel, but right now we know all how the situation is, but uh, I see it in the cards that maybe in the future you will travel, you will get this opportunity with him. And uh, I see right now that uh, he is resting, he is resting, relaxing, he is not thinking about anything, he is not trying to make any type of drama, he is quiet. Maybe he is more introverted than extroverted, but he's very, very powerful in, in manifestations. You know, he has really strong, strong um, dreams, strong uh, motivation, determination, and he wants, uh, he knows what he wants, but he doesn't see the, the value, you know, um, yet. He needs to be some time apart from you in, a, in order to realize what he has lost. And once he gathers all this, I see beautiful, beautiful next step. That's a family. That's a very happy card. Um, I see reunion. I see coming into the calm waters with you. And again, I see the child there as well. And also here, children. So... I see really beautiful, beautiful beginning, you know, you will start from the beginning like uh, new people and you will deepen the connection, it will be very passionate, it will be really like, oh, you will be surprised how he will surprise you, you know, he will be really, really um, putting a lot of effort into the connection, he will be happy that he found you, he will be happy to continue that you came back, that you accepted him, maybe that you have forgiven him and I see this beautiful new energy coming towards you that he will be able to wake up and you know to see the worth and to see the value in you in, in, the, in the connection because he will suddenly realize maybe also once he speaks with his family and friends they will help him to realize it that uh, you are the one you are the person who is really uh, loving him very much and uh, wants to offer him something stable and beautiful and loving and caring so he will be really really uh, happy to that you accept him again into your life so my dear his next step for sure will be like really positive energy and you will see each other again there will be reconciliation for some of you maybe you speak just a little bit you you just uh, you know have this connection that uh, it's it's like he's here then he's not here you know acting like a little bit like hot and cold but he will really realize that uh, you are worth it and i see also that uh, it will not take such a long time for him once he comes out of this energy you will bump into really something beautiful so i see that uh, there is a potential you know this is really wonderful news i know but uh, that's also in the cards so the cards never lie 
and I see this beautiful manifestation maybe you have dreamed also about the family coming true, you know, if your wish will come true with this card and uh, it will be something like you will be maybe moving to another location with him, maybe uh, buying a house or flat or moving into a new place, I see it here. There will be really wonderful, wonderful new beginnings. So I'm very, very happy for you. Thank you very much for watching. And if you liked it, please don't forget to subscribe, share and comment. So see you next time. Bye. Hi, part two. Welcome to your reading. Thank you very much that you are back. And thank you also for new people coming to see what's gonna happen, what is his next step. And we are gonna uh, maybe deep dive into the past connection, what, what was happening and the presence and the future of this connection. All right, so my dear, welcome to your pile reading. And let's have a look, all right? Okay. We have Nine of Cups, Judgment, Nine of Swords, the Empress, the Queen of Wands, Three of Wands, Six of Pentacles, Two of Wands, Five of Cups. All right, my dear, so I see clearly that in the past you came back together after some time of, you know, being alone and uh, uh, you were thinking a lot, both of you, about the connection. You, you were destroyed, like, you know, there was anxiety and chaos and stress, but I see that uh, your person considered you to be his wish fulfillment. That's why you came back together again. So there was this beautiful reconciliation. I also see that for some of you, currently you are pregnant. For some of you, you are pregnant or some of you are giving birth to some type of a new energy, but you are very, um, you know, able to nurture people. You know, you are very caring, very beautiful, very uh, like bl blossoming, you know, you are full of love. And I see that uh, your person might be right now um, planning, you know, maybe you might, you might be also um, long dis in a long distance relationship and he's planning to come forward and to travel towards you, but uh, right now it's not possible as we all know. And um, I see also some other feminine energy, very um, fiery energy. So there might be some other person involved in this connection. And this uh, Queen of Wands, she is very uh, attractive, very passionate, very, you know, determined. Uh, she has her goal and she goes for it. Uh, maybe there is this interference in your connection with this third person. I'm really sorry, but I see it, I have to say, for some of you, yeah? And I see three of ones here, three people, that means. And uh, this, these are two different energies, so one of them is you. So you, you can pick whichever you want, but I see two women here. Maybe uh, it could be his mom or his sister or his friend uh, who is interfering in this connection and you know it's never good when there are three people in the connection all right and um okay that's in the prisons right like i see that your person is just uh, waiting for whatever will happen uh, and for now it's paused and um, I see this third person interfering really strongly. So maybe you already know about it. Okay, um, but I see that your person really wants to, to plan and organize a trip to come towards you 
for many of you and he is really planning to work on the connection okay and uh, i also see that your person might be a fire sign or he could be a water sign or air sign but doesn't have to be all right and uh, this person really wants to work on the connection and i see that in the future he will approach you with another approach he will come like okay my dear i like you very much and i want to be with you but uh, we need to plan because there is no um, i see that uh, it could be like you don't know each other very well uh, maybe this was some kind of a really fast connection you got together and then separated got together separated you know uh, i see some um, that you want to plan you know you want to or you want to come forward and you want to really be together but for really near future i don't see something big happening because uh, i see uh, regret and i see sadness uh, he he loves you he he is very generous he is very like you know the type of a person who wants balance in his life um uh, he's very grounded and um, he is really looking at um, at this opportunity like it, it's a missed opportunity something has happened like there was not it was not able to you know to develop further so far but i'm not looking into the very very big future you know only near future so for the near future i don't see anything happening i'm really sorry but i i i see only some some tiny intentions like uh, he is just planning planning thinking about what could happen when yes but uh, still waiting for other factors to resolve first and then he will start acting for now uh, in the near future he will be very sad very disappointed and there will be a lot of, a lot of regret like uh, it's like unfulfilled wish for him because you are a wish for him, for him wish fulfillment he wants to be together with you but he's for some reason he cannot be i i really feel this strong long distance relationship here so for some of you if this does not apply please pick another pile and uh, i see that he is really looking optimistically into the future and he really wants to work on the connection but he's not able to do anything more right now he would like to have this balance with you balanced in life and he would like to continue develop and you know he maybe for some of you if you are pregnant you could be pregnant with him you just found out and uh, maybe he is really he is really sad that he cannot be there um that's really um uh, i'm sorry about that if, if it's happening in your life uh it's very devastating for both of you that you cannot be together because i see this beautiful beautiful energy that uh, yes uh, you saw this spark you know you saw this uh, this new beginning in your life but something has happened and for now it's paused it's paused and uh, you are just waiting for other things to develop my dear you uh, if, if, if it's you then there are so many people out there who are really struggling like this because of the situation what's happening and many people are separated and uh, many plans have been destroyed by you know by other third party uh, factors um so that's what i see for you right now what's happening in your life or in your connection um so please let me know in the comments below if it's happening really in your life and and what was his next step i would like to know okay my dear so if you liked my video please uh, don't forget to subscribe share and comment and thank you very much for watching and i see you soon bye hi Pelfrey, welcome to your reading 
So today's topic is what it is next step, right? Uh, we are gonna have a look at the past, the present and the future of this connection. Everything will be in this one video. There are no extended videos. And uh, please uh, take what resonates with you and leave the rest. Um, so let's have a look what we have, right? We have two of cups, beautiful. Four of wands, beautiful. Five of wands, knight of cups, Ten of Swords, Knight of Wands, Ace of Cups, The World, Four of Swords. Alright my dear, I definitely can say that you two are soulmates or twin flames. Wonderful, wonderful connection. You you are this divine counterpart of each other it's a strong connection you never felt this way with anybody else and uh, there are strong feelings maybe um you know okay i'll tell you what i see so i see that you could be dealing with the fire sign strongly with air sign and water sign and I can say that uh, maybe for many of you, you were married already or engaged, engaged. <clears throat> there was some type of a big celebration of this connection, of this union. This union was wonderful, you know, from the beginning, you felt like soulmates, like you knew each other before. And um, somehow, Somehow there was uh, there was some type of a conflict. You started arguing about something, and uh, the connection was really shaking in, in the you know foundations. And uh, I see that you could be really romantic type of a person and really like. Uh, um, expressing love a lot but your person is uh, this you know knight of wands that's a person who is really a player energy card this is a player card this person is very passionate he's very active he is very um, acting before thinking you know very um, excited about everything not thinking too, too much He's a fire sign, fiery, passionate, uh, a lot of like, you know, he, uh, a lot of drive, yeah, and a lot of action from his side. He's very determined, he's uh, into a lot of things. Uh, I see that right now their relationship has ended completely. It looks like it has ended, you are done with each other, you don't communicate, you don't want to see each other, something really, really, really painful has happened. I'm really sorry, my dears. I'm really sorry, my dear. It was really devastating for you and uh, this connection just broke because it could not last because there was so much toxicity so much negative energy so much pessimism negativity um really bad bad heavy heavy energy uh, and therefore this this connection could not uh, survive this pressure there was a pressure stress chaos uh something really bad happened a lot of crying yeah a lot of arguing, uh, something really dramatic has happened in your connection. Um, I'm really sorry about that. It, you two are made for each other because you are soulmates, you are twin flames. You, you had this beautiful, beautiful start into the connection. You had these big hopes that dreams will come true with this person, right? Uh, but something really has come to the surface and something has happened you know with these night of wands uh, you can never be sure because these people are just hot and cold they they cannot express their love like we can like like you can because you are really romantic you are this water sign for many of you it could be vice versa but i see it this way yeah i see it like you are you were waiting for this big big romance to happen and uh, at the beginning it was really all wonderful beautiful and you started to feel safe and started to open up to this 
this person but this person once you you overwhelmed with your emotions this person he went away he ran away and he just did not um, he was not able to cope with so many uh, emotions because they are not built this way right these people are like uh, they are not thinking so much they are just thinking uh, about actions acting acting all the time you are a very very uh, deep deep romanticer like very um, sweet caring you know you would like to express your feelings all the time but he is not he's not that type of a person and that's why you there was in some type of an argument uh, with this type of people they need space they need time for themselves they need freedom they don't need uh, this uh, caring loving words it's scary for them they they are fearful they have fear that uh, once they fall in love they start expressing their feelings that they they will be vulnerable with you and they have a big ego and they don't want you to see them to be vulnerable they want to you to see them like they are a macho guy you know that uh, nothing can break me nothing can do me wrong but uh, i see that something really happened in your connection maybe this was the reason why it has ended so painfully um all right so right now i see that you both of you you are done with each other you are just not talking everything is stopped but i see this beautiful you know light here right here there is a light coming so i see this beautiful uh, hope you know hope for the connection because i also see ace of cups you two love each other you two still love each other so in the future he will come and he will express his love to you and uh, it will be wonderful new beginning in love i also see that uh, the world is completion completion of this one cycle and the beginning of a new cycle and maybe uh, this person will travel to you or you two will travel together or you might just have your own business involved with the traveling uh, you know we all know how the situation is right now but uh, i see it in the future that you will travel you will uh, this card talks about rest and uh, you know just not doing anything resting sleeping you know rejuvenating relaxing so right in the in the near future i see both of you just healing you know healing from whatever has happened you are not in contact maybe just one or two words but I see that uh, this Ace of Cups, this beautiful love is still there. You love each other very, very much. You are not able to, to let go, you know. So I, I'm sure you will come back together. You are soulmates. You are meant to be together. So you are meant to teach each, each other the, some type of a lesson as well. We, we all are here for some lessons. But uh, I see that uh, in your connection, it's very strong. Uh, I, I, I heard extremes, I heard like once you are a lot in love, like like obsessed with each other and, the, and then everything is gone, everything is, has stopped and you know, there is no communication, no contact, nothing, no action from him. Right now I think he is just, you know, enjoying himself somewhere else or really healing himself but he is not thinking about whatever has happened anymore because he is healing he will be healing you will be healing you will be just thinking maybe meditating about what has happened meditating about your future what are your dreams how you want this connection to develop further i see this uh, completion of one phase and start the new phase so the I, in the future you i can say that you went through the worst already right and you might start to think might start to work on the connection again later on but you will still be healing in the healing process 
but let me assure you that there is a lot of love between you two. He is just not able to express his emotions. So if you will be waiting for this, uh, that he's gonna come and directly express all his love, this will happen only to a few of you. But he might come and he, he just says it differently, in a different way, you know, he will give you flowers or, you know, he will buy you some presents or will invite you for travel, for a trip together, you know, this way, because he has a big ego. He will not want you to see him devastated that he, you were not in his life, but he will for sure realize it. He will realize it and he will come back to you. Okay, my dear, so... That's all I have for you right now. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you liked it. If yes, please don't forget to subscribe, share and comment. And hope to see you soon. Bye. Hi, Bob 4, welcome to your reading. Okay, so today we are gonna have a look like uh, the, the past, the present and the future of your connection. What is his next step? Yeah, how he's gonna react and so on. So we have six of cups. We have the fool. We have eight of swords. Knight of swords. Seven of swords. Ace of swords. Five of swords. Five of Pentacles, seven of... Oh, no, that's a chariot. It's the number seven. All right, my dear. So, I can tell you right now that you met someone from your past, your soulmate, someone from your past life or someone from your past in this life. It was a wonderful new beginning, you know, you, it was like uh, maybe you started flirting and you didn't think that there is going to be some future with this person, but you, you actually uh, connected and uh, you stayed together. I don't know for how long, but uh, I can tell you that uh, one of you was feeling really trapped in the relationship. He was... There is a lot of thinking, I see a lot of uh, thinking energy, analyzing, you know, a lot of analyzing, maybe also from your side, if it's worth it, if, if there is going to be some, really some love or something. Um, that's what's happened in the past, yeah. Uh, I see, I see that uh, hmm, there is one problem, yeah. There is a lot of thinking and analyzing, but also I see someone stealing, lying, cheating. I don't like this energy, I'm sorry. But uh, I see that your person wants to come back to you very fast, you know, but in a cold way, like not expressing his feelings. He is just, he wants just his own victory. Um, he wants to win you from, with all the costs. How to say it in English correctly. He is very competitive. He just needs this, you know, oh, I achieved this goal. Oh, I achieved this. I, I achieved this, no matter what. He is just like a very cold person and competitive and not a nice, type of a guy, I must say, uh, cold, not expressing love and feelings, he does not have a lot of emotions in himself, oh, I can feel this energy already, he's heavy energy, heavy, heavy energy, I don't like this person, I'm sorry, uh, no, there was some type of cheating or lying about something, mm -hmm. Uh, he will come towards you, he will be like, ah, oh, let's work on the connection in a very fast way, you know, forget about whatever has happened, he's just like this fool guy, you know, like, mm, ah, it's gonna be alright, yeah, it's fine, whatever has happened, it's fine, he does not um, have a lot of feelings, emotions in himself, 
it's not a nice type of a guy he wants this clarity communication you know what has happened he wants to tell you the truth or what has happened and um, come out of this uh, energy of uh, suffering and struggling being all tied up uh, he wants to Mm. yes he is he might come to you to win you over again and but you know we have two fives five talks about conflict there's gonna be a lot of arguments and in the future i'm seeing you being still lonely still you know uh, left out in the cold you know he will come to you like Ah, he's still okay, he loves you, but he wants you, but this is just a game. I don't see any future with this guy. But then the last card talks about chariot, it talks about progress. So for some of you, maybe this person will realize really that what he has done to you, what uh, wrong he has done to you, and he will, he will um, it change his behavior. That's for some of you. So you have this chariot card there, yeah? that's a positive card, moving forward, moving, coming towards you. But I still see, I still don't see any any emotions, any love feelings, you know, that's what I don't like. Uh, maybe you should really not lose your time with this person and invest it in something real, something deep, because... You know, you have started like you, maybe flirting, you know, and in this type of a way, but I don't see you being very happy with this person in the future. I don't see him planning family. I don't see him um, uh, not think that you are his wish fulfillment, that you are worth it, that you have your value. I don't see... Um, you know, big, big plans here. He maybe wants to reconnect and to start like it was before, you know, just flirting, just hot and cold energy, just, I come when I have time, okay? I come next time, but only when I have time. You have to wait for me. But I see strongly that in the middle of the reading, this seven of swords, this person is a liar. This person is a liar. I don't see any optimistic future with this person. If this does not resonate, please pick another pile. There are many others. Okay, my dear? If this does re resonate, please let me know down below in the description box. Or in the comments um, yes that's what I see I don't see happiness with this person I don't see you know like this Sun card from Tarot or something really positive coming I see really negative energy very uh, it's I feel this deep negative energy you know he's just competitive he just wants to steal your time your heart your emotions your energy he is very egoistic person and very proud, very, uh, you know, this natural guy, maybe for some of you. All right, so thank you very much. I am sorry that I disappointed you, but uh, take it as it resonates, all right? So that's all I can say. And uh, thank you very much for watching. If you like it, please don't forget to subscribe, share and comment. And I will see you in the next video. Bye. Welcome to your reading. So today's topic is what is his next step? We are going to have a look at the past, the present and the future of the connection. You know, what uh, what are his plans, what he's planning, whether it's, if he's planning something or not. Let's have a look, okay? Okay, we have nine of wands, nine of pentacles, ten of wands, queen of cups, ten of pentacles, 
Nine of Pentacles, the Moon, Seven of Cups, King of Pentacles. All right, my dear. I see that your connection in the past was really heavy connection, uh, a lot of stress. You were both tired, you were both waiting for something to happen. Maybe you were waiting for him to give you some type of an offer, like stable offer, like a family life. You know, you wanted this uh, beautiful connection, like beautiful union of two hearts creating another heart. And uh, you wanted this stable, beautiful, uh, beautiful family in the past but you were tired yeah uh, currently uh, currently i see that um, uh, i see your person planning to have a family planning to have this beautiful wonderful family yeah having it all, all together like one package like a happy family uh, a lot of money and he's he's quite uh, wealthy i think uh, he's earning a lot of money your person is uh, focused on money and on career and his self development you know he's just uh, mm, working 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 all the time maybe he does not have enough time for you um, he might come as a little bit cold, but he is on the other hand, he's very solid, very grounded, very um, stable, um, reliable person. Um, but right now I see, I see that your person might be deciding, you might be deciding either between two people, you and the other person, or between you and himself only. Uh, that he is not able to, you know, he wants to be single, he needs time for himself, he needs to just work on himself, he needs freedom. That would be a better case, but uh, I also see uh, some other person here. Queen of Cups and Nine of Pentacles uh, person. So Queen of Cups is very emotional, you know, uh, mature in feelings. She is very loving, very caring, very beautiful. She has a lot of this uh, nurturizing energy. Um, I think it's you and he sees this in you. He wants this happy, beautiful family with you. But somehow in the past uh, you two were really there was a lot of stress and a lot of argument burdens and you you both are really tired you needed a break and i see there is this other person who is single and who is really like uh, enjoying his her life with his her money and uh, just having freedom you know uh, spending money only on himself herself um then just this is just a red flag just be cautious yeah just be cautious maybe you will see other person around your person you know this person might have a, uh, might have an eye on your person i see it strongly this person is younger than you it's a beautiful young lady she is independent uh, and she wants your person your man so just keep going, just be very nurturing, you know, be caring, don't, don't argue with your man. If you want him in the future, fight for him. You have to fight for him and, um, and yeah, just be happy and show him that you can, you can really create this beautiful home together. Maybe you already have a family together for some of you. And this other person came into your life and uh, started destroying whatever have you created you two. Uh, but I don't see uh, anything happening with this third person yet. But just be cautious, yeah? Just be cautious. And maybe when you see this person, just tell her something or whatever. Uh, that you are family with this person. You have a stable life and 
um, ask her to leave or whatever. Um, okay, in the near future, I see your man focusing on career, on his money, on his uh, uh, achievements, on his goals, you know, and uh, working hard to provide you with money and so on. Maybe he is an entrepreneur, he has his own company, he's very popular, everybody loves him, he's a very respected person. Uh, authoritative and he might have a lot of persons, people around him, you know, um, so he is kind of like used to this. But I see, I see fear on your side or on his side. I see fear. I see, uh, I see this. Uh, uh, whatever has happened here in the past, you are still taking me to future with you. Please. Don't just leave the burdens somewhere, you know, wherever you want. Just don't take them with you. Don't have them on your shoulders. Uh, I see uh, a lot of fear, a lot of anxiety, a lot of uh, hidden intentions, a lot of uh, hidden thoughts. Uh, very big intuition. One of you is very, very intuitive person. And I also see this insecurity that, you know, fear. That you you don't see the future together but my dear you you had this beautiful beautiful loving relationship so work on it yeah because uh, I see here some of you or one of you could can have more options seven of cups talks about more options this card talks about uh, many other options as well and you are right here so if you really want to work on the connection Stay as you are, be nice, be caring, be nurturing, be loving, don't cause any drama and he will have you on the pedestal. But I see a lot of other options around him. So this is a caution for you, my dear. Um, in order to go with you or pick you, you have to stand out from the crowd. I see that you had a um, this, uh, you had a past with you together. So let's work on the connection and if you want to give it another chance you can all right my dear and this is your man this is the king of pentacles he might be earth sign yeah um, these people are very uh career driven yeah but they could uh, come up a little bit cold and uh, selfish but they have a lot of lot of feelings in their heart and um uh, so right now he might be focusing on his house, you know, building a house or creating some abundance. Um, maybe he does not see this other person yet, so it's up to you, you know, that uh, you can tell this person go away, let us alone and so on. But this is just for some of you. For others of you, well, yes, I see, I see nice. In the near future, there will be some insecurity, some fear, more options, and your man will be focusing on the career. If you want to change it, you know what to do, and just stay as you are. You, you, you have to be caring, loving, you know. Maybe you have kids together already, some dogs, some cats, so really nice, beautiful house. But uh, there is this, this slight caution. Otherwise, I don't see any big drama here, right, happening in the near future. Okay, so that's all I have for you right now. Thank you very much for watching. If you liked it, please don't forget to subscribe, share and comment. And hope to see you soon in my other videos. Bye!